Hey, hey, what's going on, everybody? You are watching me, quarantined in my basement. For me, uh, we're going on day 50 three, 52, 50, 52, 53, yeah, I don't know anymore. Uh, I do, actually, I do, I'm lying to you, I do know. It's day 52 or 53. I have a calendar, I look at it every goddamn day, I mark off with a little special red pen, and uh, I keep counting like a mad person, and it's driving me crazy. <laughs> I'm dry, it's, it, it's not driving me crazy, I'm driving myself crazy. But we're all on the same goddamn boat here, I think. Maybe not. I think my boat is maybe just like a little bit smaller because it's my brain and my brain is just a little bit narrower of, of madness. And I think that I'm maybe just driving myself in a boat full of madness in my brain down a river that's eventually going down a waterfall and we're all sinking. Talking on the phone with a lot of people too. Uh, you know, just uh, and trying to figure out like the best way to talk to people on the phone because everybody wants to FaceTime all the time. They just want to see you. That was never a thing before. Before we could just text, before we could just talk to each other. But now everybody wants the Zoom, they want a Google chat. Everybody wants to talk all the time. More than you ever wanted to chat ever before. And before there were things to talk about. Now there's nothing to talk about. Now there's all to talk about. I haven't talked to you in years, and you want to talk now, and there's nothing to talk about. I've, there's nothing. There's there, there's nothing to there's nothing to do. There's no one here. I'm not doing f all. There's, I'm not having any grand life experiences. Not there's nothing going on. Nothing. To f I have no nothing nothing exciting to talk to you about. And you want to talk to me now, of all f***ing times. I've got to make time now. i got all the time in the world now, but I have nothing to say. So now, thanks for making it real f***ing awkward. <laughs> oh, f***. It's now May, uh, which is the moving into the third month of this thing. Things are good. <laughs> <laughs> a little stir crazy, not gonna lie. Been doing a lot of art. Uh, I'll show you a couple of things that I've been working on. Weird things. I've been having a lot of like weird dreams. Have you been having weird dreams? I did this one the other day. It's kind of like this like weird COVID ghost. This one is a, a tragic love story. COVID love story of Kurt and I sketched out in coroner's chalk. Deep, deep shit. Speaking of dreams, this is one that I had that, that was really weird. This, this actually wasn't supposed to turn into an art show and tell, but for some reason it did. But I had this really crazy dream, and if you've had any, leave them down in the comments below, uh, because I want to hear all your crazy dreams, because I've had crazy ones. This is one of them. We were having a funeral for somebody, and I didn't know who, who this person was. Crit and I are in our backyard, social distancing with a couple other people, masks on, dressed up in in suits and shit, all in black. And for some reason, to get rid of the body, we have to put them in a hot air balloon to get them away. And then for a part of the dream, like I was looking down at the funeral thing, so then I was like, was I in the coffin? It was a fuck, it was fucked up. I don't even, I still don't even, I still haven't even fucking recovered from that one. This one is still a work in progress. Still going. Um. <laughs> That's a good one. Um, this one, this one is for a, a friend of mine that just keeps on posting. I'm gonna tell you this this story real quick. This painting, I'm, um, I'm in the, I'm, this is, it's in its very rough uh, stage, but it's for a, a friend of mine. This person has like broken out of their shell because of the coronavirus and is like having fucking parties and going on boats and go onto the fucking beach and posting it all online. I, and with the hashtag, live in the dream. I, I have never seen anything like it before. So right now, I'm in, I'm in the middle of this one. I don't know whether or not I'm gonna uh, give, give it to him in the hospital. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. But uh, like, like a, this, is, this is something that I'm working on for that person. I did this one on the last pizza box that we ordered. This one's f***ing super avant-garde. It's called Man vs. Virus. I mean, in this case scenario, uh, we got Coronavirus 1. 
Who knows? Who knows what the outcome may be? All I'm saying, you gotta have a creative outlet. Uh, and I was online the other day, uh, I was on Amazon, and uh, I came across quite an array of, of creative outlets. Just for shits and giggles, I put in uh, coronavirus on Amazon, and it, it's already happened. Books, hats, t-shirts, songs, uh, mugs, uh, you name it. I went down as literally as far as page one and had myself a fucking ball. I'd laughed my ass off and knew that I couldn't go any further without you. And that is where today's journey begins. Coronavirus. All right, we got books. We got little squeeze toys, t-shirts, bandanas. Damn, this has actually gotten a lot more populated since the first time I saw it. Corona and Christ. Outbreaks and epidemics. Oh, that's cute. If you can read this... If you can read this, you're too close. Here's a Coronavirus Survivor 2020 hoodie. Uh, I don't know. That's a little too... That's a little too soon for me. Kind of in bad taste. Not sure how I feel about that. A coronavirus scented candle? A relaxing eucalyptus and spearmint candle. I kind of feel like I need that. You know what I mean? I'm gonna, throw, I'm gonna throw that in the old cart. Mother's Day is coming up soon. F*** it. And my mom's dead, so... <laughs> uh, oh, alright, uh, here's a, a, a coronavirus sticker. Uh, this is a baby, baby Yoda holding a, a toilet paper with a, with a mask on. I do not believe this is officially... Uh, licensed by Disney. Uh, this is not an official uh, licensed merchandise. No. Solid. Oh. Oh, here, here's some Etsy shit with a little fucking smiley face. And anxiety therapy, stress ball. Look at that guy. He's he's happy. That's a that's a that's a happy little COVID nineteen. Here's a good looking mug. I survived the great toilet paper crisis of 2020. It is a goddamn crisis. Oh shit. God damn it, I li wish I lived in Florida to buy this Calvin peeing on the coronavirus sticker. And I wish I had a truck to put it on the back of. Fuck. I can't wait till I see one day the guy fucking driving down the road with this on. God. What is that? What is that? What is that they're driving? That's a RAV4. So good. So good. Hand sanitizing station down there with the oh come on! Yeah, I would have bought that if I was in fucking high school. See, if you're a fan of Friends, here's a T-shirt for you. My 25th birthday, the one where I was quarantined, 2020. No, this is what it looks like when you're wearing it outside of the house against uh, some f uh, foliage. That's what it looks like when you're wearing it as a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Straight out of sanitizer. That's fucking funny. Oh, fuck. That's the one I needed today. Fuck. That's a good one. What is that? Unisex safety shield. What the fuck is that thing? Do I want that? Arrives June 23rd. I feel like I want that. Whoa, that thing's fucking intense. I don't need that. I don't need it. We're on it. We're yeah, just we're doing we're doing something else. All right, we're getting into the book section here. This is the uh, coronavirus haiku book uh, by Delcy Williams Dyke. We could take a look inside of this one. I hope you're ready for this. A deadly disease. Consider your life. Thinking. Smart. Practice clean life. Huh? Makes you think. Makes you fucking use, use the noggin. Here's another one, same author. Infected, many by cough, fever first. <sighs> okay, all right, okay. <sighs> you be quiet, okay? You just be quiet. How to beat the coronavirus, I don't know. That's a little soon. Coping with the coronavirus, I need that. Jesus is 
Lord over the coronavirus. I don't even know what that means. Here, the coronavirus educational coloring and activity book. That's crazy. How does it spread? Ground zero. A step-by-step -step coloring book on how to wash your hands. Oh, and then there, there, there he is, the president in chief himself. You can, you can color him. Stay the f home coloring book. Ooh, I can look inside. <laughs> Corona, that's what the coronavirus is, a little f face. <laughs> Masks save lives. Protect your mental health. Take a break from the news. Here's a good one. Dad jokes. It's a pandemic. Funny dad jokes. How do you know when Dracula catches a virus? He's always coughing. Ah! God damn it. That's a good one. Why do they call it the novel virus? It's a long story. <laughs> you want to hear a hilarious joke about the new virus? You probably wouldn't get it. You want to hear a hilarious joke about the new virus? You probably wouldn't get it. I don't get it. You want to hear a hilarious joke about the new virus? What? You know what I bet there's a lot of? I bet there's a lot of coronavirus love novels. I fell in love with an E.T. girl from the planet COVID-19, a quarantine tale. Holy shit. Huh. Um, I don't, I don't know. Uh, okay, no. Uh, my quarantine neighbor, that sounds a little bit more like it. A steamy, sensual, unexpected romance in the time of social distancing and COVID-19. Oh yeah, with the moon? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. My quarantine neighbor, that tall, dark Italian, was the hottest, most exotic man I'd ever not met. Dun dun dun. Let's see. Blah, 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 blah. Come on, let's get to the good part. His shirt was unbuttoned almost to the bottom, and his beautiful marbled chest was hairless and tanned. And he flashed his smile at her. Blah, 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 blah. Ciao, bella. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Classic. She sat on the love seat. What on earth was happening, she asked herself. And then terror struck. A symptom of COVID-19 is shortness of breath. She tried to catch her breath. And as she calmed down, it returned to normal. She wasn't struck by the COVID bug. She was struck by the love bug. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh shit. Locked together. An erotic MM story. What does MM mean? Mail mail? Uh oh. The lockdown was getting harder. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. It was getting hotter. And we all wanted to be out. I was horny. Hey, whoa, 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 demonetized. This is good. The Dr. Anthony Fauci says, keep calm and wash your hands gift mug. You're gonna love that one in a couple years. Got so many coronavirus songs. This one's by Rusty Cage. He has, this one looks like a, he is a doctor. He looks very fun. It's no cure, it's not secure. Pandemic soon begins. Oh, this is a fun one. Just stay prepared when panic settles in. It's growing fast, so wear a mask, buy plenty of extra food. Just when it was getting good. Corona, Corona. So let's all sing along. Corona, Corona. Infecting everyone. Corona. <laughs> oh, God damn it, we're all going to fucking die. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, what else? This is good. This is a good fucking time. This is this has made me feel a little bit better. Oh, what is the, what is this? The, uh, uh, the quarantines. That's a fucking funny name. Look at those. Look at those kids. But they're teens. They're not kids. They're teens. Let's let's check this one out. 
Oh yeah, all right. Oh, this is like Miami. I'm feeling some vibes. Shit. Anger. Oh, f just when I was getting into it. Damn, that's how they. That's how they get you. F I gotta. I gotta buy that one. Woo! That was hot. That was hot. That, that's what Paris Hilton would say. Well, that f***ing settles it. I'm putting the goddamn super group together. Submit some names down in the comments below. I think we got a shot at something. If they can do it, we can do it. I got a microphone right here. Speaking of microphones, uh, in the last episode, uh, in the last vlog, you said that I needed to get myself like a Wilson, some kind of uh, somebody to talk to down here in the basement. Uh, so I did just that. I made myself my very own uh, person thing to, to, to talk to. Uh, I wanted to introduce you everybody. Hey everybody, this is Bob. Uh, I want to introduce you. Uh, hey, I, I wish you wouldn't put me on the spot like this. But yeah, yeah, well, I, I mean, I just wanted to introduce you. But yeah, we'll be we'll be talking uh, with him. Uh, gonna be doing a little podcasting, you know, so if you have any questions, if you have anything uh, you want, you know, you want us to uh, talk about, uh, be sure that you leave it down in the comments below. Uh, we'll do a little, uh, we'll do a little podcast and we'll do a little talking down here, you know, in our free time, which we have plenty of these days. Hey, it's Corinne, everybody. It's got Corinne. She's coming in for the end of the vlog, doing a little dance. We were just wrapping things up here. That was, uh, what do we got? What, who's that? D-Nice. D-Nice. DJ D-Nice. DJ D-Nice. Club quarantine, bitches. Oh shit. Friday night vibes, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't, I have no idea. No idea what you're talking about. Okay, current everybody. Uh, well, that's it. Well, that is all we got here, I guess, on club quarantine. We're gonna go get our, uh, our dance on, on some weird mobile live stream, I guess. Until next time, I will see you right here, nowhere else, cause I'm not going anywhere. That's for goddamn sure. <laughs>